Tadron Carmen was also killed. Police say the Beaumont United senior was shot in his car and they discovered his body on Shoshone Avenue. Tonight, his accused killer, 19 year old Coy Dodd Jr. is still on the run. We want you to take a look at his picture. Police say he's considered armed and dangerous. Now, Tadron's death has left his family shocked and as you can expect, heartbroken. 12 News reporter Ebony Coleman spoke with the family today in Ebony. They're not only leaning on each other for support, they also want to send a message. That's right, Brenda. Tajan's family describes him as a good kid who kept busy. They say he loved to do it all. He was involved in welding and a welding program at Beaumont ISD, and he also loved bull riding. I am going to really, really, really miss him. Since 17-year-old Tadron Carmen was little, his family says he's always lived a full life. He did fishing. He loved hunting. That full life was cut short after the Beaumont United senior was found shot to death Tuesday night. I had just called him at 8.03 and um, told him to come home. He was like, yes, ma'am, I'll be there in a minute. Carmen's mother, Tracy Thibodeau, says 30 minutes later, she noticed her son still wasn't home. He told me that he was at a friend's um, house, rah, rah, but I didn't know where he lived. After his phone went straight to voicemail, the family began to worry and search for Tadron. As we passed Shoshan, that's why we seen all the lights. Beverly West, Tadron's grandmother, says they pulled over. Moments later, a BPD detective confirmed that Tadron had been shot in his car. They identified him by his tattoo on his arm. The family believes he was in his car with several people, including 19-year-old Coy Wayne Dot, who is now a suspect. This is like somebody he don't even should be involved with. And what the connection is. See, we, un we don't know. Thursday, Tadron's family and friends gather at his home to remember his life. I lost one of my closest friends. His parents now pleading for the person responsible to come forward. You need to turn yourself in because you ain't nothing but a coward. And I don't know why you done that to my son. Tadron's mother says they plan, she plans to lay her only child to rest. March the 30th, she says he was just a few months shy of his 18th birthday in July. In studio, Ebony Coleman, 12 News.